John, the first time you and I met, you showed me the Haunted Mansion wallpaper on your phone as yes. if to say that right. I too am a Disney file. Yes. Given yes. the depths of your Disney fandom, what does it mean to you today to be named a Disney legend? I, you know, I found out about it through a letter that I wasn't expecting or anticipating in any way. I've passed by uh, Legends Plaza with, you know, and I've always looked at it because on the Disney lot, I pass by it whenever I go uh, to meet with them. And the names in there, you know, there, there are some names everybody knows, but there's also names that, unless you're an animation fan and Disney fan, you don't know. You got, you got all the innovators in uh, the parks, Imagineering, Animation, Nine Old Men. It was really started off as something that was really just internal for Disney uh, and the people that Disney wanted to honor because of how they uh, developed the, the, you know, what, what the studio has come to stand for. Uh, and then it, it's been slowly expanding out to include people who've, who've also been involved with the, you know, on screen with the movies and filmmakers and stuff like that. But to me, the part that makes it really special is is that it, that it has honored the, the the legends of the past that uh, are responsible for the type of storyteller I am now by being influenced by them.